So you're not an audio engineer, but you still want to edit your podcast, ad, webinar, or even meeting audio. Good news is you don't have to be an audio engineer to make it sound at least 80% better. Here are three things you can focus on if you don't have that much time or expertise. Number one, breaths. It might sound unnatural to get rid of every single breath in your audio, but if you look for those exceptionally large breaths, usually represented by a large hump in the waveform of the audio, and get rid of those, or at least silence those, your audio will sound a lot better and less breathy. Number two, mouth noises. They usually show up like little vertical lines in your waveform audio, kinda subtle. But if you're listening to the audio, they're anything but subtle. They're kinda gross. Quickly scan your audio waveform for those little vertical lines and listen for the gross mouth noises. By eliminating those, you automatically make your audio sound a lot more professional. And number three, tighten it up. Really all this means is get rid of any blank space or long pauses in your audio. Now with the exception of silence, which can be used as a powerful tool, think the power of the pause. Usually blank space isn't good to have in audio. Your audience appreciates it if you keep your audio tight and moving along. Now you can spend a lot of time making your audio perfect, or you can spend a lot less time and get it 80% of the way there.